can only show you the door. You have to walk through it. Bitcoin investors piled $875 million into BlackRock fund amidst crypto rally. BlackRock spot ETF recorded $875 million of inflow on the 30th of October, surpassing its previous record by around 3%. Canary Capital filed for spot Solana ETF with SEC. The crypto asset manager has now filed for a Solana spot ETF after getting the ball rolling for a spot XRP ETF and a Litecoin ETF earlier in October. Hello guys, welcome to the Crypto Matrix. I'm Mr. Legend. In this video, we take a look at general cryptocurrency market. We're having a pullback in the last week of October 2024. October has lived up to its expectations. October has been very, very crazy. We've seen Bitcoin rally to as high as $73,000. We've seen renewed optimism return back to the altcoin market. What's in store for the crypto market in November? Is the market going to see a top in November? Are we going to continue charging to higher values? We'll be talking about that and more in this video. Let's get down to business. Bitcoin, the king of the market, has been setting new all-time highs in various currencies. But against the US dollar, Bitcoin, Bitcoin's price got to $200 to a new all-time high. But we have not broke to new all-time highs. Bitcoin price got to as high as $73,000, $700. Can Bitcoin get to new all-time highs in the month of November? That will depend on plenty of factors. But guys, right now, Bullish news around the market is a lot. The sentiment around the market is very, very bullish. Greed has returned back to the cryptocurrency market. We have even seen extreme greed. The crypto market used to have this period of time where we see extreme greed, but it doesn't last for a very long time. You want to take advantage of extreme greed in the cryptocurrency market, and we believe we are going to see all season in the coming days and the coming weeks. Let's start with liquidation in the cryptocurrency market. This rally has been primarily driven by bears getting liquidated. The last 24 hours has seen more than 44,000 traders get liquidated with the highest liquidation coming in on, on OKX. One trader was liquidated with $1.34 million trying to bet on the price of Ethereum. Total liquidation lost from all those traders was $105 million. You want to be careful out there, guys. The market is going to be here. There's going to be plenty of opportunities. If you use leverage, you want to, you want to use a small multiplier because you can easily use your hard-end funds trying to time the market be careful out there guys right now the meme coin market is having a very very good time the meme coin market has been rising over the last one month the general meme coin market cap sitting at 64 billion dollars 24 hour trading volume sitting at around 8.7 billion dollars the meme coin market has been seeing huge huge gains the meme coin market has been the most productive sector in the cryptocurrency market in 2024 are we going to see memes continue pumping in 2025 only time we tell right now sentiment in the market is good and canary capital fight for solana spot etf with the sec the crypto asset manager has now filed for a spot etf on litecoin xrp and solana in the coming and the coming weeks we might see the altcoin market taking off but remember guys to take some profit off the table the biggest bitcoin boom we have in town microstrategy has big plans for Bitcoin. MicroStrategy is planning to raise $42 billion to buy Bitcoin in 2021 plan. In 2021 plan, crypto commentators are bullish on MicroStrategy plan, predicting it to propel the company ahead, not just other firms, but also countries too. The whole significant portion of Bitcoin right now, Mike Silo started MicroStrategy is gearing up to raise $42 billion over the next three years to accumulate Bitcoin, the firm has revealed. The plan dubbed 2121 plan will consist of $21 billion in equity and $21 billion in fixed income security over the next three years, according to the statement from MicroStrategy on the 30th of October. At the time of the publication, $42 billion in Bitcoin is equivalent to around 578,000 BTC, accounting for 2.7% of the supply. MicroStrategy is going gangster. They want to buy as much Bitcoin as possible. Will this come back to buy them in the ass or will this be the trade of a lifetime? Only time will tell. But Bitcoin investors are piling into BlackRock Spot ETF. We saw the largest inflow on the 30th of October 2024, surpassing the previous record by 3%. Bitcoin Spot ETF is on record. Bitcoin Spot ETF holders are on record buying huge, huge bitcoin since when bitcoin etf launched in january of 2024 we have seen big big inflows the figure has supported ibit's previous high of 849 million dollars set on the 12th of march 2024 is it the, is this the top for bitcoin guys we saw bitcoin topping in march of 2024 we saw bitcoin 
not being able to rally above the seventy-three thousand dollar level on the twelfth of March, twenty twenty-four, is history repeating itself. Open interest for Bitcoin is at an all-time high. The altcoin market is waiting for Bitcoin to give us the next direction, and I believe the altcoin market will start flying to higher prices. But all eyes on Bitcoin dominance right now. Bitcoin dominance hovers around the sixty point two one percent region. Bitcoin dominance has been known to be the key to altcoin season. Bitcoin dominance going higher. It's good for the altcoin market in the long term, but in the short term, it's draining liquidity from the altcoin market. I'll not be shocked if in the coming days and coming weeks, if in the month of October, in the month of November, we we'll see Bitcoin dominance having a spectacular dumped goblin town, which will lead to chaos in the altcoin market. That chaos will happen because altcoins will be pumping to higher prices and market participants will be left on the sideline. This move with Bitcoin towards $73,000 was not driven by buyers. It was driven by short sellers getting liquidated. And I expect that similar situation to happen in the altcoin market with Ethereum, with the whole other altcoins that have not been performing well over the last few weeks. I believe people shorting Ethereum and other altcoins are in for a rude awakening. I will not be shocked to see Ethereum rally towards $3,500. And guys, that rally can happen very, very quickly. Crazy things can happen in the cryptocurrency market. We could easily see Ethereum rally now by 20 30%. It can happen in 24 hours. We have seen stranger things happen in the cryptocurrency market. Let's take a look at news, other news stories going around the cryptocurrency market. Russia, Bitcoin's AI play with Brexit is game theory in motion. Crypto Titans back, clothing firm suits against SEC on written rules. Riot revenue raises 65% from 2023, but says hash rate plans hampered. Crypto app sees malicious pop up after Ace Drainer hack animation library and Robin who doubles crypto trading volume but shares deep 12% on Q3 earnings. Let's take a look at the altcoin market. Total altcoin market sits just near the $1 trillion level. Total altcoin market in the cryptocurrency market is valued around $944 billion. In the coming days and coming weeks, with hopefully with the rise of Ethereum pumping to as high as $3,500, we might see the altcoin market go above that $1 trillion level. It's even possible for it to get to as high as the $1.1 trillion region. But guys, be very, very careful when the end game, when the point in time where you should be taking some profit off the table. If you're not taking some profit off the table, if your coin has not yet pump, you should be getting ready for that big, big pump because you want to buy low, you want to sell high. This rally will not last forever. We have been pumping for the last two years. For the last two years, Bitcoin has not seen a 30 plus percent decline. That's strange. That's very, very strange for Bitcoin. Bitcoin is a volatile asset. And right now, with the S&P getting to new all-time highs, with the Dow Jones getting to new all-time highs, with Bitcoin also cracking new all-time highs and gold cracking new all-time highs, I'll not be shocked if 2025 is going to be bloody. I'll not be shocked if 2025 will mirror 2022. Remember to take some profit off the table. The higher we go, the more riskier it becomes. Coinbase is preparing to work with either Harris or Trump presidency. The elections is coming this week. A lot of market participants are keeping eye on it. 5% of US voters identify as a single issue crypto voter. We have seen Coinbase deep after hours on softer markets, Q3, any means. And countries are still adopting crypto. Kazakhstan CBDC pilot drastically reduced VAT and VAT refund weight and Reddit offloads most of his Bitcoin and ETA holdings. This cycle has been very, very crazy. We are seeing institutional investors sell. We are seeing retail investors buy. We are seeing some institutional investors buy. Where will the market head to in the coming days and the coming weeks? We feel like there's a lot of confusion in the market. Let's take a look at returns that Bitcoin has given us in the month of October. October has always been known to be a very good month for Bitcoin. This year is not the exception. We had a green September. Right now, we're having a green October. Bitcoin has rallied up by 14% in the month of October. History has shown us over time that when Bitcoin has a green September, a green October, usually have a green November and December. But will this time be different? I have a very sneaky feeling that Bitcoin might top in the first week of November. Only time will tell whether I'm right. Top 10 cryptocurrency by market capitalization is still unchanged. Tron, Ton, Dogecoin, XRP, USDC, Solana, BNB, USD, Theta, Ethereum, and Bitcoin make up the top 10 cryptocurrencies by market capitalization. Gold is setting new all-time highs. Bitcoin is setting new all-time highs. We are waiting for Ethereum to join the party. Ethereum, the king of all coins in the cryptocurrency market, currently trades around $2,640. In the coming days and coming weeks, guys, watch out for that big, big pump for Ethereum. Ethereum can easily surprise market participants liquidity in the BS with a rally towards $3,500. Guys, thank you for watching this video. 
don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more awesome videos like these turn on the post notification if you want to get notified anytime i drop a new video anytime i go live remember guys when it comes to investing nothing will pay off more than educating yourself an investment in knowledge pays the best interest invest for the long haul don't get too scared don't get too greedy see you guys in my next video remember all i'm offering is the truth nothing more